Domestic violence is on the rise amid the COVID-19 pandemic. A local organization says the need for its services has doubled since the stay-at-home orders were issued. Fox 12's Amber Wilmarth is in southeast Portland to show us how a group of food carts is now helping them. Vendors here at the Portland Mercado are cooking meals today that will be delivered to domestic violence survivors and their family members. It's a service that's helping to meet a growing need. While Oregon's stay-at-home order is meant to keep people safe, there are some who are suffering more because of it. Brenda Kinoshita with Clackamas Women's Services tells us the organization is now sheltering twice as many domestic violence survivors. She says their emergency shelters give them a safe place to stay, but they all don't have full kitchens. That's where the Portland Mercado vendors come in. Today, they're cooking 44 meals here. Once the meals are loaded up, they'll be delivered to the survivors. This is being done in partnership with Hacienda Community Development Corporation, and it's all paid for by Principal, a financial company. There's a, just a terrific partnership here where we could get vibrant, culturally specific meals for the survivors in our emergency housing program, and the vendors could have income to tide them over during this period. Helping the businesses uh, stay in business, uh, and then also helping people in need. And the cooking doesn't stop today. By the end of the week, a total of about 100 meals will be made here to give to survivors in emergency shelters. While the Clackamas Women's Services offices are closed right now, staff say they are still there to help survivors of domestic abuse 24-7. For more information, we do have links to resources on our website, kptv.com. Just look for the online version of this story. Reporting in Southeast Portland, Amber Wilmarth, Fox 12, Oregon.